Hello everyone, this is me, Sakya here, and I'm back with the third week of February read, start from the 15th through the 21st of February 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Aries. So Aries, let's see what's coming in for you for this week time. Um, just be mindful, it's a general reading. It may not, may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what's coming up for you, Aries, for this week time. Let's begin. The Hermit, Ace of Swords, Five of Pentacles, and Ten of Wands. Underneath the deck, we do have Four of Wands. There has been something um, that that was worrying you in recent times. I really see that worries coming to an end during this week time. Um, if it was financial worry, if it was like something to do with your work, you wanted to sell, buy something or something like that, I really feel like you know that's things are going to get sorted out for you during this week time. So if you have been feeling um, lack of uh, financial stability, I really feel like, you know, the stability is going to return back to you um, during this week time. And I really feel like, you know, your stress levels are definitely dropping down for sure during this uh, week time. Um, the reason is going to be like, you're going to get an idea. You're going to get a thought, which is going to help you um, pursue something, which uh, if, if you pursue that idea or thought, um, it is going to, you know, um, stop putting you back on track. I feel like, you know, things are going to stop rolling for you. Um, so make sure that whatever you're intuitively feeling towards, make sure that you take action um, during this week time around it. Whether it's a thought, whether it's an idea, whether it's a creative thing that you're kind of like, you know, feeling an intuitive pull for, go ahead, do that. Because I really see you getting success in that. Um, if we talk about your love life, I really feel like, you know, um, if you felt like, um, things were not going well between you and your specific someone. You felt like, you know, they're leaving you behind or they are like, you know, uh, ignoring you, neglecting you. Um, I really feel like, you know, you just have to um, bury the worry you are having right now around it. Because I really see um, this person, whoever it is that you're dealing with, they will be spending a lot of time with you during this week time. You will be communicating a lot. You will be kind of like, you know, um, staying in touch a lot. So something that you were being kind of worried about, I really see that, you know, dying away. Um, you will feel more stable, more at peace from within. Um, I feel like, you know, for some of you, you are having a lot of doubts and fears around it, but you don't have to worry. I really feel like the you know, divine support is with you whether it's a financial situation or whether it's a love life situation. If you felt like your person is ignoring you, neglecting you, and you felt like they're leaving you behind, they are not. They might have been busy with something. If you are not the working person, maybe your person has been busy with their work, financial struggles, and that could have kind of like, you know, um, got, the, uh, got your person invested in that issue, uh, which could have been the reason why they could not spend more time with you, but they are going to be like spending time with you now. They will be giving themselves to you in this connection. So if the two of you are living at a distance, your person might pay you a surprise visit and resolve the issues and fights and conflicts that you were having. So really see things sorting out in your life and you will be having a good time spent. There's a lot of growth, abundance that I see coming for you during this week time. Let's see what else is happening here for you during this week. Okay. We do have the sun and we do have the envy. I really feel like, you know, for a majority of you, just be mindful that there are people around you in your life who are envious of your happiness and envious of you and your success. Make sure that you keep um, less to no contact with those people. Make sure that you cut ties with some people who are always jealous of you or envious of you or your success. Um, they, they can be, you know, they can kind of like, you know, um, pretend to be your friends or maybe they pretend to be a good, um, you know, person in your life, but they are not. I feel like, you know, you know who they are, but you really have to make sure that you protect your energies and your home life and your work life from these people. You know, make sure that you don't share your ideas with the close people that you feel are your friends. I feel like, you know, they can take advantage of your ideas and then, you know, make you feel like kind of like, you know, left out 
um, maybe they can steal your ideas or something like that. So make sure because I really feel like you know, there is somebody out there who is uh, wanting to steal you or your idea or something to do with that. So make sure that you protect yourself and your energies in the home life and work life. Um, I really see uh, good times coming for you especially when it comes to your love life and your emotional life. I really feel like you, know, you are going to feel very happy and positive. Um, if there has been conflicts, like I said earlier, um, this time is going to be the time where you're going to feel like, you know, the conflicts are, you know, resolved between you and your person. And um, I feel like, you know, somebody is willing to tell you what they have been up to. And um, if, especially if you felt like you were, uh, not told anything about you know what's going on in your person's life they will be telling you the whole story about it so the clarity the information that you need is definitely coming in so let's see what else is happening for you during this week time what else is coming in for you during this week time <sighs> the divine really wants you to buy some clothes you like because i really feel like you know you might be going on a date with this person in the days to come uh, during this week time you will be having maybe if they are visiting you maybe they are traveling with you know with you or maybe you're going to be planning a travel with this person you might be traveling to see them they might be traveling to see you um make sure that you um uh you know um make sure that you that you um put yourself in that vibe where you are preparing yourself for the meetup or you know the divine really wants you to exchange your energies uh, so make sure that you are doing something good to uplift someone else so the energy that you give to others is reciprocated to you through the means that you want uh so yeah let's see more cards here i feel like you know um your prayers are getting answered um you have been a person who has been very pure in their intentions and pure in their heart uh this is the time when you are going to get rewarded for all the love and you know um all the love and your 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 purity of heart that you have been investing yourself into this connection with uh, this is going to get rewarded. Um, I feel like, you know, for some of you, the divine is telling you to kind of like, you know, um, give up your worries and do get a haircut, do something cool for yourself because the bad days are gone. It's time for you to start taking good care of yourself and, you know, uh, allow the abundance that I see coming in for you. Um, so the worries are definitely going away. I feel like, you know, for some of you, uh, if you're upset with something and you're feeling left out um, and you feel like, you know, your person has um you know left you for someone else the divine really wants you to start taking good care of yourself uh buy some new clothes pray a form around you know whatever you desire in your love life and the god is going to be kind and bring you someone who is going to be of uh, you know uh, who's going to be worthy of you so make sure that you make room for new energy and uh, um yeah do something good for yourself and cheer yourself up um I feel like, you know, the spirit guides are definitely with you, helping you, guiding you. And it's time for you to listen to the divine messages coming from your higher self. And uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, week time. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care and bye.